we see that Jesus was forsaken by the Father during the time that our sins and the sins of the whole world were placed on Him. Matthew 27, verses 45 through 48 says, Now from the sixth hour until the ninth hour, there was darkness over all the land. And about the ninth hour, Jesus cried out with a loud voice, saying, Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani, that is, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Some of those who stood there when they heard that said, This man is calling for Elijah. Immediately, one of them ran and took a sponge, filled it with sour wine, and put it on a reed, and offered it to him to drink. These verses remind us that God the Father can never look on sin with favor. As a result, during the time that Jesus was bearing our sins, the Father covered the whole land with darkness, even though it was the middle of the day. We see that our sins were placed on Jesus from the sixth hour until the ninth hour. Finally, as this time was coming to a close, Jesus cried out with a loud voice. The very fact that Jesus could cry out with a loud voice at this time shows that Jesus was still strong even during the time that He was forsaken by the Father. This is also a reminder that no one took the life of Jesus from him. Instead, he willingly gave up his life to pay for our sins. He came to do the will of the Father. Hebrews 10 verses 5 through 7 says, Therefore, when he came into the world, he said, Sacrifice and offering you did not desire, but a body you have prepared for me. In burnt offerings and sacrifices for sin you had no pleasure. Then I said, Behold, I have come, in the volume of the book it is written of me, to do your will, O God. Jesus fulfilled the will of the Father, even though it meant broken fellowship and separation from the Father. That broken fellowship is why Jesus cried, Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani, that is, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? We see that Jesus quoted this statement from Psalm 22, verse 1, which says, My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Why are you so far from helping me and from the words of my groaning? We see that Christ was forsaken so that we could be forgiven. He was forsaken so that we can enjoy fellowship with the Father. 